Greeted the Shropshire lads as the Telford fans packed in to cheer their team on. You could hardly breathe on the terraces or in the stands, and it wasn't long before the crowd of just over 8,000 were in full roar. Darlington looked startled as Telford charged at goal. And when you consider the United players had been at work all day, they had plenty of steam left as Ken McKenna brought the first save out of the Darlington keeper. And it was McKenna again who had the fourth division side panicking with a shot that flashed across the face of the goal. There was no stopping the non-leaguers now. Darlington escaped again when Paul Maiman's shot was pushed wide. Then after 35 minutes, the first goal came. McKenna headed on along clearance and Dave Mather's boot did the rest. The celebrations, though, were nearly brought to an abrupt end when Darlington broke and Kevin Charlton was forced to pull off a fine save. But the real killer blow came just before half-time. Just watch this 30-yard free kick from Eddie Hogan. And you'll not see a better goal than that all season. If that had Darlington reeling, well, they were dead within 25 seconds of the second half. Charlton's long clearance bounced perfectly for John Alcock, and again, the finishing was breathtaking. A few minutes later... Darlington immediately countered. Some slack defence lets in McDonald, whose cross is almost converted by Todd. With half-time seconds away, Telford struck again. Hogan's free kick won Pele would have been proud of. The second half began in the same amazing fashion. The ball is passed back to Telford keeper Kevin Charlton, whose long kicks are a speciality. His kick eludes the Darlington defence, and John Alcock cracks home goal number three. In the latter stages, Darlington pressure, but Joseph clears off the line from Todd. The home crowd were baying for the final whistle now, and they didn't have too long to wait. A marvellous victory then for the Gola League side, whose fans were determined to enjoy every moment. In 15 meetings with league opposition in the FA Cup, Telford have been beaten just twice. No non-league club has a finer record.